So right here I'm just going in with a primer. This is just a KDB primer, but you can use any one that you have. And then we are going to take two foundations and I'm just mixing the KDB and the NARS just to give myself a fuller coverage. Pixie's color correct just to correct my dark circles and then we are going to take the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer along with L'Oreal True Match. Um, you can use any concealers that you have but we are just going to highlight all of the normal areas that we would highlight but I want you to really build up that concealer that way those areas look a lot lighter than the rest of your face. ahead and we are going to take a beauty blender and just blend out all of those highlighted areas and then we will take the Laura Mercier eye brightening powder and set our under eyes. Then I'm going to go in with my Baked Mineral Powder by KDB, and this is a darker powder. So what I'm doing is I'm setting my foundation, but only in the places that I did not highlight with the concealer, because you don't want to go over those light areas with the darker powder. And then I'm just going to go ahead and fill in my eyebrows. And for the eyebrows, you don't have to do anything special. I just made sure that they were filled in very, very good and we're one solid color. So right here I'm going in with some concealer. You can also use an eye primer and just lay it down on your lids. Okay, so now I'm taking the Kat Von D Contour Eye Palette. You do not have to have this for this look. All you need is a white shadow and like a cocoa brown. Okay, so right here I'm taking the white shadow and I'm just highlighting underneath my brow. And you just want to bring it down a tiny bit. And then we are going to go in with a flat brush, just like we're using here. And we're going to take that cocoa powder and we are going to place it onto our lid. going to take a blending brush and we are going to dip it back into that shadow just very lightly and then we want to blend out that line just to kind of make it fade into the white shadow and um, just soften it a little bit. For the little white spots what I'm using is the L'Oreal Magic Lumi Conceal Corrector and you don't have you can just use regular concealer if you want to or if you have a you know actual Halloween makeup you can you know do some white paint but um, I just used the Magic Lumi stick and it was really really easy. Um, these circles don't have to be perfect like as you can see I'm just laying it down really really easy so um, and your lashes will cover most of it anyways. Okay and here I'm going in with a NYC eyeliner and it's a liquid liner pen. It was like three dollars I think 
and I'm just giving myself a cat eye. You can go as dramatic or not as you want with this. Um, it's always hilarious watching myself do this because I never wear a cat eye, but I love them now, so <laughs> I always practice. Again, with that blending brush, and we're gonna take that cocoa brown powder, and we're going to just buff underneath the eye. Later in the video, you will see me going back and using a smaller pencil brush to add a little bit more. Then we're going to go in with the Double Up Ardell Lashes. These are the 203s. They are very, very big. So if you can find the Double Ups in a smaller one, I suggest doing that because these are very, very heavy. going to take a NARS eyeliner in black and I'm going to line the inner corners of my eyes just to make it look like the lash band is continuing and not just stopping. And then I'm going to take some mascara and I'm just going to push the real lashes and fake lashes together to make them feel better. And then take a white eye pencil and I'm going to line my waterline and this just helps brighten up your eye and open them up a little bit more. And then I'm going to take that mascara and I'm just going to apply it to my bottom lashes. Now for the contouring. So I'm just taking this KDB contour palette and a small brush. Okay, so all you need is a really dark powder and then like a medium powder and then either a translucent or white powder. Okay, so I'm starting contouring my head and I'm just going to put it very heavy on my hairline and then I'm going to blend it out to kind of make it fade a little bit as it goes into the white part on my forehead. And right here you want to make sure you suck your cheeks in to really get the chisel of the cheeks. And I'm kind of doing a swooping motion like a Nike check on the cheek to um, bring out my cheekbones even more. And you're just going to continue this on to the other side and make sure that you also get your jawline. And then I'm going to take another brush and take that medium powder and I'm just going to apply it on top of the contour and this just kind of bronzes up, bronzes, bronze up my cheeks a little bit and helps that dark contour kind of fade into it, kind of like an ombre look and I'm just doing the same for my forehead. Then I'm going to take a smaller eyeshadow brush and I'm going to take the dark powder and contour my nose. And you want to do this pretty heavy, so just do a little bit at a time and just build it up. And make sure you, as you can see, I'm taking it up into my eyebrow to meet my eyebrow. So just go into the corner of your eye. Okay, so I'm also going to contour underneath my lip. It kind of just helps push that bottom out, bottom lip out a little bit more. And then we're going to take a tapered brush and take that white powder and we are going to highlight and set all of that concealer and just help that white bright area pop even more. Okay, so for this part, I'm taking the NYC liner and I am creating a V shape on my nose 
Um, you'll see here in a second that I actually have to go back and correct it because I feel like I put it too far up. So make sure you bring it down a little bit and it's also crooked because my nose is kind of crooked. Um, so make sure you bring it down just a little more than what you see me doing here. Otherwise you do look too much like a kitty cat. Um, okay, so we're just bringing it down to the nostrils and then you are just going to fill that area in and the little part down your nose. Okay, so if you don't have liquid liner, then you can also use eyeshadow if you want to, but kind of just create like a little heart on your nose. Here is where you can see me correcting what I did. So I just kind of wiped it with a baby wipe and then put some concealer on it and then finished my contour. But I did bring it back down a little bit. But in the rest of the video, like right here, you won't see it corrected because I didn't fix it until the very end of the video. So anyways, just make sure you bring it down a little bit more. And then after we do that little tail thing, we are going to fill in the top of our lip with the liner. My camera died on me, of course. <laughs> um, but we're just going to finish filling it in. And then we are going to take a brush and some black eyeshadow. And I want you to set all of that concealer that you just put on to your lips and your nose. Here is just where I'm setting all of that eyeliner with some black eyeshadow powder. Right here I'm going to go in and just darken up that contour just a little bit more just because you really really want it to stand out so go back and touch it up as needed. And then I'm not sure where the clip went but I just took the NYX Nude Truffle Liner and filled in my bottom lip and then just put a nude lipstick over it. Then we're going to go back in with that Lumi pen. Remember you can use just regular concealer. That's what this is. It's just an a pen form. And we are just drawing little tiny dots all over our cheeks. Um, they don't have to be perfect. You can, you know, do any kind of design you want to, but I just kind of placed them wherever. So, and then we're going to do the same thing for the forehead and then our look will be complete. is our finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you have any questions please leave them down below and I will answer them for you. And if you do this look please tag me or send me a photo. I would love to see it. And happy Halloween!